I'm overdue for hatching a shiny. I'll put it that way. Uh, I've hatched like over ten. I, I anyway. You useless so, all the things that i've said uh let's get into this actual game so we actually saw it was tay juice versus joshathan uh sorry sassy last week sassy took it um and one notable thing about that matchup is that apparently the luigi zero to death does not work on bayo because that within comes out frame one. Oh, that is actually really cool to know um at least this is what we were told last week um so, could be relevant against another Luigi. But as we saw, <laughs> Sassy didn't even try to go for any of shenanigans with uh, Grab. Yeah, he's going for shenanigans right now. <laughs> oh, yeah, no, he goes for shenanigans. Oh, no, do not, do not misinterpret me. I, there is, there was one time last week where he charged up Side B twice fully. You know, like the one where it, like, peters yeah. out. And then he just ran up up B. The mind game. It was just like, because the opponent was just like sleeping after watching him do that for like 30 seconds. Okay, yeah, that's not safe. And just back through Bayo and sort of thing. And we're actually versing against Amaryllis, who's been getting a lot of really good wins in the last few months on, during the Wi-Fi era. So this is not a, like a Bayo 2 slouch on. Yeah, oh, <laughs> what an edge guard. Really smart using the long lasting up air from Bayo to be able to uh, get the stage spike. And just like that, I thought this game was going to kind of be a blowout after that huge lead that Sassy took. But now we actually have, for the most part, an even game here. Yeah. And it looks like Sassy's just waiting for Amarillas to just make a mistake. <gasps> Speaking of mistakes. <sighs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, kind of, it's Bayo. Bayo off stage isn't actually that scared. Yeah, it, nothing to fear. Although, <laughs> but there is no. the traditional one Bayo SD they do every set. Oh yeah. Well, I mean that's how you that's how you power up the the engine. You, you re it requires a blood <laughs> sacrifice. <laughs> um. Now, also speaking of off stage, I think that that's where this match is going to be won for Amaryllis. The ability to, oh. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah. But we already saw it close out those kind of earliest stocks. And wow, calling him out, just going for the tomahawk grab. Is this actually going to be a stock here? That, yeah, that's, wow. that's a stock. That was, that, that was like almost no SDI up there. Helper subscribing. Yeah. Yay. 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 Thanks, Humble, for this, for subbing. <laughs> All right. Oh, yeah, I was about to say, I, I, I like Emeralis, how he's going onto the platforms with this lead, but Sassy Flygon is not afraid to go up there and try and challenge him. Um, as we saw, he was using the up, the, the down B. I've seen him just run up up B before to catch on a platform. So, and in the end, takes the stock regardless. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. When... Kind of went for, I guess that must have been a miss input on the down smash. Yeah. Seen a few. Oh, just chased Sassy up there. I was not expecting that. And we actually seen Luigi's Nair get used. That's yeah, not a tool you see a lot. Or at least rising there. Falling there, yeah. Nair to combo break, but just uses Nair, I guess, as a uh, just. Get some nice solid damage when he's not confident. Yeah, even then, the Luigi's tend to use um, down B as the combo breaker. Oh, that's of right. Frame yes. one invincibility. It is frame one invincibility, but it's also much riskier. So if you're, yeah, you know, if you're worried about your opponent kind of reading you, but you know, yeah, oh. and right there, that's it. Yeah, that was the down B, right? But the bat with him got him out of it. Yeah, there's a lot of lag with it that comes with it. So. I mean, of course, it's a fantastic combo-breaking move, but... Oh, and yeah, he was doing it quite a bit. We saw right there. Tried to punish it, and actually the forward smash didn't work, but... Yeah, just did not... Just fell out of the multi-hits, and then bat within the last one. Yeah. And back to really that, that's the privilege. Smash. <laughs> uh, it's a battle that's, of privilege, <laughs> you know? Yeah. I don't, I don't know. that. I feel like the... Which... Uh, the bats within right there... 
that's some DLC privilege that transferred over from Smash 4. It's like... <laughs> it's like, yo, you still got your rights here. <laughs> All right. Now You're not as rich, but mm -hmm. you're still rich. All right, now we're moving into game two here. Uh... Okay, let's see if something a big combo. No! Good DI yeah, but... from Amarillo gets him out of the worst of it. Yeah, and now we just see Underworld is chasing and doing damage back on, and you can't really escape on Bayo combos as easily. <laughs> Especially if you get hit in the wrong spots. And you got single hit right there. And the down B, the Luigi Cyclone just getting him out. I was wrong. I didn't think he was gonna get out. <laughs> yeah, that must have that must have been some good SDI in the middle in order to uh <laughs> I have some questionable DI, but he's living, so it was optimal. Yeah. yeah right. Caught the air dodge onto there. This game is now completely even. Only about 5% separating these two. They're both looking for kills, trying to throw out big moves. I think that should be it, though. Yeah, make sure that the back air is not going to clank with the uh, forward oh. back. But then, just immediate answer. Yeah, th these guys have been going back and forth. Now, it, I also think that it's worth noting that once, uh, when Amaryllis had the lead... <gasps> He's good. He's oh, he's alive. Wow. Oh, Amaryllis. <laughs> always alive. Um, but when Amaryllis gets the lead, he likes to jump on the round on those platforms. So, uh, oh, wow. the love tap. That's enough to do it. Yeah. It's caught on battlefield. And now we have a, com this is just a, a, this pure stock lead for Amaryllis. Oh, what's, what's going to happen here? All right, Amdurill is camping the platform, and I don't agree with that. Luckily, Amdurill is was at an early percent. Yeah, trying to prep. I, I like the idea of wanting to pressure Sassy when he's in the corner, but that seems to me like Sassy's trying to bait him, actually. he's Instead of going to center stage, he's going to the corner. Because yeah. for the most part, that's when <laughs> that's when he's actually trying to go in, and he angled oh. the shield. Yeah, he, Back here. and he grabbed him through that because he, he had the bullets through there. Most characters get stunned and not able to do anything, but Sassy knows that he can get a grab through here. And But he's on his last stock and he needs to do something, and that is it. 2-0 on the relics. Yeah, and although we normally don't see Bayo combos kill like that in this game, the fact that he was getting them started so close to the blast zone... Uh, yeah, like he's hanging out at these. That's one of the reasons why he's hanging out at the top platform like that, so he can get the down angled um, afterburner kick and just, yeah, take him all the way up there. Yeah. Yeah, it's he's like, that's. Uh, I'm really excited to see more Emeralds throughout the bracket, and I wonder if he's going to take that approach frequently. I actually think that maybe this wasn't the best stage. Just based no. on how those platforms really helped out Amaryllis. Just from getting between like getting those really big combos that actually led to kills, just being able to camp them when he wasn't comfortable. Um definitely that stage felt like it was much yeah. better. And I think that there. this was the big stock right here. The stock yeah. that just killed him at fifty when from just chasing him super deep, like looking at it right here. And this is when like that. <laughs> yeah, I mean, at the well, same yeah, time, that's to be expected, ball. you know? Wait, oh yeah, he got caught on the, the under. Would he have made it back? No, what was that? I don't think he would have made it back. But yeah, he, he bumped. Oh, Devin, you have colors now? Yeah, we have you have, have colors. What? We have like the, 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 the football things where we just draw things? Oh my god. Oh, <laughs> uh, just the evolution of stream. We're gonna have that in offline, right? Can yeah, we? Can we get little, oh, how crazy it would be 
to get like touch pads.